you were back in prime time. There were a couple of times where you were almost back in prime time. And this is a show that is also about resilience and about coming back from disappointments and near misses and things that didn't work out. And I'm wondering what you have brought from those experiences to this role and to this show, because you've had things not turn out the way that we thought they were going to the past couple of years. Here's what I've learned to really trust <laughs> about this industry is that you don't want a role or a show that you're not right for, or the show isn't quite right yet. You don't want that. And so those things kind of go away. When I think about New Girl, um, I actually tested for a pilot the year before for a show. And this is before I had learned that lesson of like, what's meant for me will be meant for me. I'll be the right choice and they won't be able to avoid it. So I'll get it. Um, and I tested all the way up and I didn't get it. And that show got picked up and it ran for a year over what was where the new girl casting was. So if I had gotten that role, I never would have been able to go and audition for new girl. That show got canceled like a month later. So I, and I spent that whole year feeling sad, thinking I've missed the show that I was supposed to be on. But thank goodness with um, Not Dead Yet, when this show came to me, it was instant family. Forget how great this show is and it's great and it tells important stories and it makes people who watch it feel seen in their grief, in their mess, in all their awkwardness and weirdness. It captures it and tells it so beautifully. It's great escapism television with a heart. But for me personally, meeting Josh and Gina and Lauren and all of the cast, Angela and Rick, if I have any of those things that had happened in between New Girl and Now had been picked up, I never would have formed these friendships that now are so meaningful in my life. Um, I wouldn't have gotten to tell so many of these great stories that Not Dead Yet gets to tell. So um, I'm grateful 